Good morning. This is Pastor Bo Wagner with your morning minute meditation from the Higher Grounds podcast. I'm here at my desk at the house and I've got a cool little toy in front of me. In case you haven't seen it, it's mesmerizing. This is called Newton's Cradle. I saw one of these on my grandfather's desk when I was a kid. Fell in love with it. Had to have one now that I'm an adult. It's more than a toy. It's actually a physics tool. The principle it demonstrates is the conservation of momentum. Simply put, the energy is transferred all the way through the stationary objects from one end of the line to the end of the line. Um, this one is the one that's hit. This one's the one that takes the brunt of it. But we're not here for a physics lesson. This is actually a spiritual lesson I'm thinking of. Saul got upset with David, tried to kill him. But in so doing, he ended up having a fallout in 1 Samuel chapter 20 with his own son, Jonathan. He actually threw a javelin, a spear at his own son and tried to kill him. He wasn't aiming, wasn't aiming for Jonathan. He was aiming for David. And yet because he, he was trying to hit David, he ended up hurting Jonathan over here. There are some people in life that I don't particularly care for. People in the ministry I don't particularly care for. In general, if they're doing a work for the Lord, I try to keep my mouth shut about them because I know that if I strike them because of some personal grievance, somebody else down the line that I wasn't anticipating hitting is going to be the one to take the brunt of it. And I don't ever want to do undue damage, something that's not called for. Be careful with your personal grievances. When you air them out online and in public, you may be aiming for this one, but this one's the one that's going to take the force of it. That'd be a real tragedy to hit somebody that you weren't intending to hit while hitting somebody that you were intending to hit. Be careful with people. The Lord loves them and died for them. This has been Pastor Ray Wagner with your morning minute meditation for the Higher Grounds podcast. We'll see you next time.